Nobody needs to ask the question, what is my purpose? It will always be found in service. If you can just for one day put your attention on making life better for someone else, if you can focus on thinking like that, that's how God thinks. It's an ancient concept, but it's still relevant. To touch someone's life is more valuable than any amount of money. My friend Byron Katie says, to believe that you need what you don't have is the definition of insanity. That you can't be fulfilled until you get all these things, that's an illusion. Really, you don't need anything more. It doesn't matter what it is you do. You could be a cab driver, a teacher, a factory worker, a manager. What matters is that you put your attention on how may I serve. Think of the people you go to, whoever you are in your path. You can run an entire business this way, not being attached to outcome, putting attention on service. Your life becomes about living those virtues. How can I serve? How can I be gentle? How can I be reverent? Thinking like that means you're living in meaning. The messages of the morning are about what you can and can't do, about how society defines you. But in the afternoon, after the shift, it's about connecting to an energy that's taking care of everything, and we're all just being done. Try to stop yourself from breathing, from your fingernails growing. Living the virtues is all we need to do. The truth is, I feel something else is in charge of all of this. So it's really about surrendering to it. Surrendering to something that is bigger than you, that you are connected to, and that's really in control of everything. There's a place deep within us that wants to feel fulfilled, that wants to know that my life has made a difference, that I've left this place, this planet that I've lived on, better than when I arrived, that someone's life has been profoundly touched because of my existence. We all want that. It's not about age or about finding yourself. Wherever you are, at whatever age, you're only a thought away from changing your life.